The solution to my battery charging woes is this, the Syncwire Mini Car Charger. So it says it's simple, superior and reliable. Input, 12 to 24 volts, 3 amps max, that's a given, given that it runs off car electric or a battery or whatever it is. USB A output, 5 volts, 4.5 amps, 9 volts, 3 amps, 12 volts, 2.5 amps, up to 30 watts maximum. USB C output, 5 volts, 2.4 amps, 9 volts, 3 amps, 12 volts, 2.5 amps, 15 volts, 2 amps, 20 volts, 1.5 amps, 30 watts maximum. Shared output, 5 volts, 4.8 amps maximum. Got it. Cable included, it's USB-C to USB-C, 1.5 metres and it's nylon. Designed with PD 3.0 USB-C port and QC 3.0 USB-A port. Single port enable fast charging up to 30 watts max. If charged the laptops, make sure the car charger input voltage is above 20 volts. Very careful with that because you might flatten your battery. One and a half meter USB-C cable contains to charge more devices conveniently. Multi-protection system ensures the charging is safe and secure. Sleek cigarette light connector is firm enough to minimise interference. So in my car, I've gone for a much smaller device because where my devices charge is where I also have the drinks holder, which is a bit inconvenient, but by using this, I should have more space. Let's get it unboxed. There's a USB-C cable and the charger itself, which is absolutely tiny. Wow, that's really small. Um, just to give you an idea, there's USB-C <laughs> compared to it, it's really small. Uh, so that's gonna just sit flat in my car, which we will do in a moment. And that's really nice. Uh, so two ports, as we already know, We've got QC up to 30 watts, PD 30 watts, up to 30 watts rather, with USB-C charging. Not much else going on in the box, just user manual and warranty policy. So we'll go into my cheap, cheerful motor car and I'll show you the setup. Okay, so here is the internal setup of my Sandero. So on the top, I have an Anchor Bluetooth speaker, which I've had a good few years. What you see in the Sandero, in mine in particular, there is no in-car entertainment system or sat-nav. So what I do, I have that Bluetooth speaker. I have my phone on here, which I'm currently filming on, which is why it's not there now. And then I have down here, apologies for the mess in here, it does need a valet. Um, I've got this Anker IQ charger, which I've had quite a while. And I charge my phone and also my Bluetooth speaker from there. So... You'll see it's quite quite chunky in the uh, in the electric outlet. So what I'm going to do is use this new Syncwire one. I'm going to swap it out and get this setup changed. So we'll take the old anchor one out, and then we'll put the Syncwire one in. I want to get it so that the text is the right way up, and that sits really really shallow now there. Uh, so I can actually use the drinks holder again without this being in the way. So I'm still going to keep the anchor one because I do have two cars. This one's going to use, going to go in the back and it's going to power my children's phones, uh, that kind of thing. So plug that in and USB-C cable that now is going. This is USB-A to USB-C and of course with this sync wire charger we've got C to C. So we'll plug that in. Oh, that's solid. Is that that locks right in? So I'm impressed with that. And we'll just plug the Bluetooth speaker in as well. So both devices then will be charging from that. And then just going to wrap the charger around a little bit so that it's not getting in the way when I am driving the vehicle. Plugged in the fast charger into my tablet and as you can see there it is charging. So I've now been using this Syncwire mini charger in my car for over a week and I've found it is excellent. It does exactly what you expect in a very very small footprint. There's very little I can say about a uh, USB car charger um, but this one 
ticks all the boxes that I needed ticking and it's low profile and it's enabled me in my Sandero to get my drinks area back uh, so that's that's pretty good if you are looking to buy one and you're looking to support my channel somehow then if you do click the link below in the description then that will help my channel very much if you've enjoyed this review and you want to hear more please hit like please hit subscribe any support you can give me is very much appreciated and it does encourage me to carry on making videos like this i'll see you next time Thank you.